Flights are becoming more punctual. Airplanes can now predict their own maintenance needs, and artificial intelligence powered co pilots are now assisting in optimizing every decision in the cockpit. These advancements are now transforming aviation, and in this video, we're going to talk about the cutting edge AI application in aviation with focus on these in air traffic control. Artificial intelligence is revolutionizing aviation, and AirPass is leading the way. In aircraft manufacturing, AI-driven systems inspect materials in real time, catching tiny defects that the human eye could miss. This means that we will have safer planes, build faster and more efficiently. This shift toward digital transformation in aviation is not new. Boeing, for example, the huge American manufacturer pioneered this concept with the Boeing 777, which was the first commercial airplane to be designed entirely using computer-aided design instead of physical prototypes. This innovative approach set the stage for today's AI-powered innovations in aircraft design and allows manufacturers to simulate aerodynamics, optimize materials, and streamline production before a single part is built. But artificial intelligence does not just stay on the ground, it's reshaping the skies too. In air traffic management, AI analyzes real-time flight data to reduce congestion and delays to help air traffic controllers make instantaneous decisions that keep flights moving smoothly. Recently, AI has become a game changer in air traffic management as it's leveraging powerful data analytics, machine learning, and automation to enhance operational efficiency. And now we will take a look at some of the AI models and projects that were recently implemented in air traffic control. AI-driven predictive models help manage airspace congestions, allowing air traffic controllers to anticipate and adjust flight routes for smoother operation. For example, the ISOBAR project has developed AI-powered models to predict and mitigate capacity imbalances caused by unexpected weather disruptions, reducing delays and improving airspace efficiency. Machine learning digital assistants analyze historical data and real-time flight information to support the human operations in making faster and more accurate decisions. Let's take, for example, the project ISA. This ISA project has introduced AI-driven situational awareness tools that help controllers manage complex air traffic scenarios more effectively. Also, AI enhances flight route optimization by considering weather conditions, airspace restrictions and the traffic patterns and therefore reduces the delays and fuel consumption. Let's take for example the Alarm project. This project has developed a prototype system that predicts hazardous weather events, which allows aircrafts to avoid turbulence and volcanic ash clouds. And last but not least, there are also AI projects and models that contributed to the cybersecurity of air traffic management. Let's take for example the Synapse project. So this model enhances security in air traffic management by detecting and preventing cyber threats targeting air traffic control systems and communication networks. This project is integrating AI-based cybersecurity solutions to detect vulnerabilities and prevent cyber attacks on aeronautical communications network. And these are just a few ways uh, artificial intelligence is transforming air traffic management for more efficient and uh, safer flights. But let's now talk about one specific AI-driven model that has been recently launched and implemented in one of the busiest airports in Europe, which is Heathrow Airport in United Kingdom in London. In December 2024, Heathrow Airport implemented an innovative air traffic control method known as pairwise separation, which was developed through the CESAR joint undertaking by NATS and other partners. This approach aims to enhance punctuality and reduce carbon emissions. Usually, traditional aircraft separation relies on six categories based on weight and wake turbulence. In contrast, uh, the pairwise separation technique customizes the minimum required distance between the incoming aircraft by considering the specific characteristic of each aircraft type. This detailed method enables air traffic controllers to safely decrease separation gaps for certain aircraft pairs, improving therefore the traffic flow. Early results indicate that 
pairwise separation has basically increased landing grades at uh, Heathrow Airport, reducing therefore airborne holding times and significant carbon savings over time. This development is part of the intelligent approach tool initially deployed at Heathrow in 2015, which uses dynamically calculated time-based separation instead of static distance-based gaps. The introduction of pairwise separation is expected to add the environmental and operational benefits already achieved. The head of operations at Heathrow Airport Billy Stone noted that implementing these technologies like the pairwise separation enhances operational resilience, benefits passengers by minimizing holding times and supports environmental commitments. While also the director of aerospace and future operations at uh, NATS, Chris Northworthy, emphasized that this innovation improved service quality for airport and airlines customers positively impacting punctuality and reducing emissions. Extensive research and validation of pairwise separation were already conducted by NATS and European partners as part of the CESAR 2020 Research and Innovation Program. So NATS basically is the main air traffic control service provider in the United Kingdom and it manages and controls air traffic within UK airspace and provides air navigation services at several major UK airports. Overall, the adoption of pairwise separation at Heathrow represents a significant advancement in air traffic management, offering benefits in efficiency and environmental impact. Heathrow Airport became the first airport in the world to implement pairwise separation in air traffic management system. This new approach significantly improves the way air traffic controllers manage the spacing between landing airplanes. Pairwise separation goes a step further by customizing the distance between the arriving airplanes based on their specific characteristics, such as the the, the size, for example, the speed and the aerodynamics so that the airspace can be used way more efficiently. So to rephrase it, and in other words, the, the pairwise works by introducing a totally new way of calculating the minimum separation between the arriving pairs of aircrafts. As we mentioned, Traditionally, separation is based on six categories, taking into account an aircraft's weight and the amount of wake it creates as it flies. While the pairwise separation is calculated using the specific characteristic of each individual aircraft type. By allowing for closer but still safe separations between certain aircraft pairs, Heathrow can now handle more planes in less time. What makes pairwise separation even more impressive is how it builds on its previous innovations. As we mentioned earlier, back in 2015, Heathrow introduced time-based separation, or PBS, which replaced the traditional distance-based separation with time-based intervals, considering real-time weather conditions like wind speeds, for example. Pairwise separation, the system takes another step forward by factoring in the individual aircraft characteristic. This means the controllers can fine tune their separation strategies, improving the flow of the traffic even in adverse conditions, such as strong headwind. The benefits of pairwise separation goes beyond just reducing delays. Fewer delays means fewer planes circling in the airports, burning less fuel and emitting the fuel pollutants into the atmosphere. So it's worth mentioning also that this pairwise separation technology was not developed overnight. It went through extensive research and testing as part of the CESAR 2020 program, a collaboration between NATS and other European partners as we can see from this figure. This research focused on ensuring that these new technologies would meet the highest standards of safety and efficiency. 
And in conclusion and overall, the introduction of the pairwise separation marks a significant step in air traffic management, making Heathrow a global leader in adopting smart technologies to improve air travel with the ability to safely manage more flights with fewer delays. This advancement is setting the stage for the future of aviation. So that was everything for this video. I hope that has been informative for you and thank you very much for viewing.